Have you ever felt like your world was ripped apart by someone you deeply trusted? Imagine this, you've been carrying a secret, a truth that only you and a loved one share. But one day, out of the blue, you discover this secret has been betrayed. The person you thought was your ally has left you a message that shatters everything you believed in. This is the story of betrayal many of us encounter, and it can feel like a punch to the gut. You're left grappling with shock, pain, and a whirlwind of emotions that seem impossible to navigate. Why does betrayal cut so deep, and how can we start to heal from it? Stick with me until the end of this video, and you'll discover how to transform this pain into a source of personal growth and strength. We'll dive deep into the journey from betrayal to healing, exploring the emotional stages, coping mechanisms, and practical steps to reclaiming your life. Let's embark on this path together and discover how to turn betrayal into a powerful catalyst for personal transformation. Why does betrayal hurt so deeply? It's a question that many of us have asked ourselves when faced with the sting of betrayal. Whether it comes from a partner, friend, or colleague, betrayal cuts through our sense of trust and security like a knife. The emotional fallout can be intense, leaving us reeling and questioning everything we thought we knew about the relationship. When we experience betrayal, it's not just the act that causes pain. The underlying feelings of betrayal shake our sense of self and our place in the world. We start to doubt our judgment, question our worth, and wonder if we can ever trust again. The road to recovery can seem daunting, but understanding the nature of betrayal and the emotional impact it has on us is the first step toward healing. To make a long story short, betrayal is a profound violation of trust that can shake the very foundations of our lives. It's a test of our emotional resilience and personal growth. In the following sections, we'll explore the depth of betrayal, the emotional roller coaster, and practical steps to heal and rebuild trust. Let's dive into the heart of this journey and discover how to emerge stronger on the other side. Betrayal often comes with hidden traps that can further complicate the healing process. One common trap is the tendency to internalize the betrayal as a personal failure. This self-blame is a psychological trap that reinforces feelings of inadequacy and can delay emotional recovery. Understanding that betrayal is a reflection of the betrayer's actions and not a personal deficiency is crucial. Another trap is the cycle of revenge. While it may seem satisfying to get even, revenge can often lead to more harm than good. It perpetuates the cycle of negativity and prevents you from moving forward. Instead, focusing on your healing and growth can be a more constructive approach. Forgiveness is a powerful tool in overcoming betrayal. It is often misunderstood as condoning or excusing the betrayal, but it is a way to release yourself from the grip of anger and hurt. Forgiveness is a gift you give yourself, freeing you from the emotional burden of the past. Forgiving doesn't mean you must reconcile with the betrayer or forget the incident. It means letting go of the resentment that keeps you from moving forward. Studies have shown that forgiveness can lower stress levels and improve mental health. Source, Journal of Behavioral Medicine Rebuilding trust is one of the most challenging aspects of recovering from betrayal. It requires time, consistency, and transparency. Start by setting clear boundaries and expectations with those you interact with. Communication is key to rebuilding trust, as it helps to clarify misunderstandings and establish new norms. It's also essential to be patient with yourself and others. Trust is not rebuilt overnight, and it often requires demonstrating reliability and commitment over time. Remember, the goal is not to rush the process but to build a foundation of trust that can withstand future challenges. Self-care is crucial when dealing with the aftermath of betrayal. Prioritize activities that promote emotional and physical well-being. This can include regular exercise, healthy eating, and adequate sleep. Engaging in hobbies and interests that bring you joy can also help shift your focus away from the betrayal. Consider meditation or mindfulness to manage stress and foster a positive mindset. 
These techniques can help you stay grounded and reduce the emotional intensity of betrayal. Additionally, seeking professional support from a therapist or counselor can provide valuable tools and strategies for coping. Support systems play a vital role in the healing process. Surrounding yourself with understanding and empathetic friends and family can provide comfort and validation. Sharing your experiences with others who have faced similar situations can offer insight and encouragement. Support groups, both in person and online, can be valuable resources for connecting with others who understand the pain of betrayal. These groups offer a safe space to share experiences, gain perspective, and receive support from those who have navigated similar challenges. Emotional resilience is the ability to adapt to and recover from adversity. Developing resilience involves building coping skills and maintaining a positive outlook despite difficulties. One way to enhance resilience is by practicing gratitude. Regularly reflecting on what you are grateful for can shift your focus away from negative experiences. Additionally, cultivating a growth mindset can help you view challenges as opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. Embracing this perspective allows you to learn from your experiences and emerge stronger from the ordeal of betrayal. Setting boundaries is crucial in protecting yourself from further emotional harm. Clear boundaries help establish what is acceptable in your relationships and interactions. It is essential to communicate your limits assertively and to uphold them consistently. Boundaries also involve recognizing when to distance yourself from toxic individuals or situations. Protecting your emotional well-being sometimes means deciding who and what to allow into your life. Betrayal, while painful, can offer valuable lessons. Reflecting on the experience can help you better understand your values, needs, and expectations. Consider what you have learned about yourself and how to apply these insights to future relationships. Identifying patterns or red flags that led to the betrayal can also be beneficial. This awareness can help you make more informed decisions and avoid similar situations in the future. Betrayal can impact your self-esteem and sense of identity. It's important to take steps to rebuild your self-confidence and self-worth. Engage in activities that reinforce your strengths and achievements. Celebrate your successes and acknowledge your resilience. Reconnecting with your passions and interests can also help restore your sense of self. Investing time in what makes you feel fulfilled and valued is essential for regaining confidence and perspective. Understanding why someone betrayed you can provide closure and context. While this doesn't excuse their behavior, it can offer insight into their motivations and circumstances. People betray others for various reasons, including personal insecurities, unmet needs, or external pressures. Reflecting on these motivations can help you process your feelings and move towards forgiveness. It's important to remember that understanding the betrayer's reasons doesn't mean you have to accept or condone their actions. Moving forward after betrayal involves adopting new perspectives and approaches. Embrace the opportunity to redefine your relationships and expectations. This may involve reevaluating what you want and need from others and setting new standards for your interactions. Approach future relationships with a balanced view, acknowledging the potential for trust and the importance of maintaining healthy boundaries. This perspective will help you build stronger, more resilient connections. Personal growth often stems from adversity. Use the experience of betrayal as a catalyst for self-improvement and development. Set goals for yourself that reflect the insights you have gained and the person you aspire to become. Embracing personal growth involves being open to change and willing to challenge yourself. Pursue opportunities for learning and self-discovery that will contribute to your overall well-being and happiness. Professional help can be invaluable in navigating the complexities of betrayal. Therapists and counselors can offer support and guidance as you work through your emotions and develop coping strategies. They can also help you explore underlying issues and patterns that may have contributed to the experience. 
Seeking professional help is a proactive step towards healing and personal growth. It demonstrates a commitment to your well-being and a willingness to constructively address the impact of betrayal. Ultimately, creating a future beyond betrayal involves envisioning and working towards a life that reflects your values, goals, and desires. Focus on building meaningful relationships, pursuing personal fulfillment, and achieving your aspirations. Embrace the lessons learned from the experience of betrayal and use them to guide your path forward. By fostering resilience, self-awareness, and personal growth, you can create a future that transcends past pain and embraces new possibilities. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the complexities of overcoming betrayal. We hope this video has provided valuable insights and practical strategies to help you heal, rebuild, and move forward. Remember, healing is a process, and it's okay to take your time to navigate through your emotions and experiences. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more personal growth and emotional well-being content. Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below, we'd love to hear from you and create a supportive community. If you're interested in exploring more topics on healing and self-discovery, check out the links in the description box for related videos and resources. Remember, you're not alone in this journey. Stay resilient, and keep moving forward. Until next time, take care and be kind to yourself.